I saw this. What do I say next? What do I say next, camera? Hi guys, Kat here, as I'm hoping you know right about now. So I know it's been a while since we've done, you know, this nice little one-on-one -on -one thing we got going on here. So today I'm just going to do a really nice quick little tack haul for you guys. Um, just to sort of, you know, ride you over from my last one. So because you guys seem to really have enjoyed my last tackle and it's got the most views and most likes out of all of our videos, I thought, you know, why not? Just do a little quick one. So to start off with, I'm pretty much going to go right back to the start of this year with this. So I just got this nice little key comb. It's just like aluminium. Um, I haven't really used it very much. It is a little bit dirty though because uh, Moses' mane is pretty disgusting. But it's really nice. It's just got a little, little horse head on it. Nice and pretty. So for Christmas last year, now I guess it is, um, Brittany just gave me these nice little bell boots. Pretty plain and simple, just double like so. They're just nice, they're just made out of neoprene, the Roma brand. Um, they're, they're plain black, obviously, as you can see. I haven't really used them much, but I'm pretty excited to be able to start using them now that Moses and I are going to start jumping. So earlier this year, Alicia and I went to see Monty Roberts when he came to Australia. It was an absolutely amazing experience and if you guys would like us to make a quick video because I took some videos while we were there, please leave a comment down below saying whether you would like it or not and maybe we can make a video like this dedicated to what we learnt and what we thought. So when I was there, I obviously I got a book. Uh, so I just got the Monty Roberts The Horses in My Life book. I haven't quite finished it yet, but it's an amazing book. It's really very inspiring, the horses that he's worked with and all of the things he's learnt from them. So also while I was there, I got one of the dually holders. So I just got the standard full size, in which uh, like it only comes in the black. So it's got the training nose band at the front with the rings. and I do use it because Moses has, as what Monty would say, a face like a block of wood. <laughs> He can be very, very stubborn, like especially around meal times, which is annoying. Earlier this year, I decided I wanted to get a saddle blanket, like a thinner one, because I've got what's called a puff pad right now. And so I thought I should get a half pad to go with. So, half pad. Um, so this is um, faux sheepskin, it's not real. Um, it's got really nice long billet straps, which I've kind of got a problem with because my saddle blankets, the billet straps are really, really short, which is very, very annoying. Um, so it is in just the white. And I would like to do a little shout out to um, Tack Shack, which is who I got this from. Um, this is really good quality. It didn't take very long to come here and it was really cheap. I absolutely love it. So while I'm talking about things I bought online, the bridal came online too, guys. It's a beautiful bridle, the leather on it is such good quality. I love all of the red and all of the bling, it's amazing. I think it's really pretty. It also came with these really nice just rubber reins with some leather on it. They, I haven't, I don't normally use these, um, but I really, really like this bridle. It's, it's beautiful, it matches Moses. So another thing I got on one of my trips to Horse Sand was just this purple massaging mitt. So Moses can suffer from a sore back sometimes after we've been doing lots of cantering or jumping. So this is really nice. It just helps get away some of the dirt and the dust and also give him a nice little mess up. But here in Australia, winter is upon us. It's getting pretty cold. So that kind of cold for a nice thick jacket. So I've got this beautiful kind of like tealy blue color. It's, um, it's really nice. It's kind of, I don't know what brand it is. But it keeps him really warm. It's a windbreaker, so it stops all the wind, and, but it's not really big and bulky. It's very warm. I love it. One thing that I got, will, which you guys will have seen in pretty much all of our recent videos, is a dressage whip. So it's just like got the nice little silver cane top, and it's like all silvery and glittery and black, and you know. By far, my most favorite purchase that I made within the last month was these beauties. So I've just got here the Ariat Zip Up Heritage 3 boots in chocolate brown. These are really nice. Um, my feet can be actually quite hard to fit. So these are an absolute perfect fit. The leather is such good quality and I would really recommend that you guys buy them. 
I went to Horseland again last night. It's like my favorite shop and it's a very short walk from my school. So sometimes after school I do go and have just a little shopping spree. Just a little one. So one of the things I got was this spiky miracle brush. It's a Roma brand. It's purple, obviously, because you know, purple is like our favorite color. Um, we do actually have these in the riding school where I keep Moses. Um, because I was going to, we were all going to that riding school before we got our horses, and so we got these, and they're really, really good for getting out all of um, unmalted hair and dirt, and they are incredible. I reckon you guys should. Um, if you got a horse and near you, definitely go and buy one. This one lady put me back $6.95. It was totally worth the money, so you guys should definitely go and check them out. I got Fetlock, Fetlock boots too. So these are just the black ones to go with my open front jumping boots. Um, they're the size large, Roma, obviously. They're really nice, nice and brand new. They've got, which I didn't know until I actually took them out last night, is that they're double locking. So they've got one Velcro strap and another one. So they're just nicely contoured through here, if you can kind of see that. Um, they're, ne they're neoprene, just like the open front jumping boots that they got. Also, when I went to Horseland last night, I bought a little surprise for Alicia, which hopefully, hopefully, you guys are going to see in her first tackle, which I'm going to make her film really, really soon. Thank you all for watching. I've really enjoyed sitting down to make this little video. I like to pull out all of my gear sometimes just to admire it and, and you know, be a bit weird. <laughs> Please guys, comment, like, subscribe. It means the absolute world to us. It really brightens our day and help us get to our goal of 50, to 50 subscribers. We would really like to get at least 10 likes on every video from now on. So if you guys could help us get to that, that would be awesome. Thank you guys, we love your faces, goodbye!